welcome back to my channel. Make sure to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button because who'd want to miss one of my videos. So, I'm going to go ahead and do my makeup today. Uh, we, with everything going on, my boss is having me come in at 12 to 5. I get a little bit extra time in the morning, which means I can do my makeup. Uh, usually I wake up literally an hour before I have to be to work. Sometimes it's like 40 minutes. <clears throat> and so, it's not really optimal time to do my makeup. So, let's get started. I'm just gonna kinda talk through this. Okay guys, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I did have the audio for this video, but I decided to delete it and cover the, the video with my own audio because honestly that that video was just so, not negative but it just surrounded so much about what's happening right now which isn't a bad thing but I just wanted a little bit more positivity and just to talk a little bit more about myself ha 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 not to be a narcissist just kind of what's happening in my life right now so right now I am still working like I said at the beginning of the video I'm working Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. Monday, I come in from 12 to 5. Tuesday is 8 to 12, and Thursday is 12 to 5. I have four days off in the week. I have Wednesday off, and then I have Friday through Sunday off. So, one thing that's been happening in my life, I've been, so ever since I moved to Reno, I've been constantly working. I haven't really given myself time off. With that being said, I haven't worked long enough anywhere to get vacation days until this job itself. Uh, but frankly, who wants to use all their vacation days to do nothing at home? Not me. So, one part of me is really grateful for this time off because I have been needing it and I didn't want to use my vacation time. I just need to recuperate, bring myself back to a good mental spot, and that's what this time has been doing. On another note, though, it's so much time off that it's... I don't want to say overwhelming, but you, it's easy to slip into doing nothing. And all you people at home, I think you understand what I'm talking about. Because some people are at home every single day. Whew. Oh my goodness. If I was at home every single day, I don't even know what I would do. Some goals right now with the time off that I do have to get myself back on a schedule is to set, a set aside time for reorganizing my house, cleaning it up, getting it back into order. Because frankly, it's a mess in here. I mean, it's not super messy, but it it's enough to freak myself out because I'm home all the time. I'm able to live in this environment a lot more than I would. And it's just too messy for me. I can't, I can't deal, y'all. I can't deal. <laughs> Need to get it all back in order. So I'm excited to do that. Uh, I'm excited to have this free time to be able to do that because oftentimes part of my job is to babysit the property and if someone were to come in to look for an apartment, I am there for that. I am there to help them in any way that I can. So it's just, it's nice to take away that free time and bring it on home. Uh, and as I said earlier, yes, I do have vacation days at my job that I'm at. I've worked here for over a year now. But, frankly, who wants to use that to do nothing at home? And with that, my vacation days, what I had set aside to do this year, which I'm not sure if it's going to happen or when it'll happen, but I'm staying positive with the whole subject. Well, one a couple of the days were going to be used to go see my new nephew. He was just born the other day. And, oh my gosh, guys, he is the epitome of cute. All babies come out turning like aliens, but man, after a couple days, they start going into their their bodies and who they are, and it is just the cutest thing in the world. <sighs> He's just got the cutest little chunky little face, and I just want to squeeze it. And my family does this thing where, like, you noty bodie, which is you, like, boop their nose. And I just want to noty bodie his nose. He's just, oh my gosh. Anyway, another <laughs> another part of my vacation days is Brady and I wanted to go visit Texas, make sure it's somewhere we wanted to move to. And so, I don't know if that's going to happen this year, but I'm not being negative. I'm sure it will happen. Just a matter of time. Uh, it'll happen when it needs to happen. You know what I mean? Maybe it just wasn't meant to be right now. It'll happen in the future. 
Uh, and so along with that, with this free time, I have more time to cook dinners at, at night, which is awesome. But on another note, it's hard to find all of the items to cook a meal. So I am interested in seeing what I can come up with as there's less ingredients, but I have a lot in my pantry. So I'm excited to see what happens with that. Maybe I'll do a video about foods to cook during quarantine. <laughs> um, but yeah. That's kind of my life. Last bit is I have put Brady and I on a fostering home because the Humane Society has had an influx of animals coming in due to everything that's happening. So I'm excited for that to happen and to get a little one to take care of during this time to help give them a, a home for a little bit uh, while they are able to take in more animals. And yeah. You can let me know, know down below what you're doing during this time. I'm excited to hear that. Everybody's going through something a little bit different, so leave it down below. Okay, guys, this is the finished look. You know what? It started off weak, but it ended strong. I like how it finished off, so I'm not mad at it. So I will see you guys next time. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week. Remember to think positive. Like I said last week, uh, the biggest thing is we have to remember the pollution is diminishing in so many different areas. Um, people are really coming, to, coming together and being just kinder. So just appreciate the little things even though all this negative is happening. I also want to thank all my new subscribers for subscribing. Thank you guys. I really appreciate it. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.